Hey, it's Mac time. I'm Master Mac, and today I'm here to show you how to straight lace your boots. You may have also heard this referred to as bar lacing or ladder lacing. I have two sets of boots here, one with an odd set of eyelets going up the boot and a second one with an even set of eyelets going up the boot. The method for each is different, and I'm gonna show you both. For these here, which are the first boots I ever owned, they have 11 pairs of eyelets going up the boot, and for 11 sets of eyelets, you need shoelace that is about 65 inches. And these here, which I refer to as my skin and stoppers, or my 20s, have 20 eyelets going up the front of the boot, and for boots with that amount of eyelets, you need 95 inches of lace to achieve this look. So, let's go ahead and get started. Alright, we're gonna get started by doing the odd pair of eyelids first because the method is a little bit trickier there. Take your lace, thread them through from the outside in to the bottom two eyelids on either side of your boot, like so. Now take one side and go up on the same side, coming out of the eyelet like this, and go across to the other side, in, over the top, like so. What you now have are your first two bars set, and you have laces on the same side of the shoe. From this point on, the goal would be to go up to and across to the other side up to and then across to the other side like so starting with the lace that's on the bottom from the inside we come up and out the very next hole on the same side of the shoe and then immediately go across to the other side and thread in like so make sure it's taut now take from the same side you started, go up to the, the other hole again, out the same side and across over the top. On the inside, from the outside going in, now you ended up with the laces on the other side. You repeat the process starting with the one from the bottom, from the inside, coming out the very next eyelet and going across and into the eyelet on the other side. Same with the other one from the inside, going up to the next available eyelet, and across to, across to the other side like so. From the outside in, every time. This is what you end up with so far. Keep going. So start from the one that's on the bottom, go from the inside up to the next available outlet, eyelet, and go across the other side. It's a pattern that we're repeating here. So taking the next one, going up from the same side and across to the other side. Going in from the outside. Each time ending up with your laces both on the same side of the shoe. So starting with the lace that's on the bottom, come up from the inside out and go across to the other side from the outside in. Same thing with the the next one. Go across from the outside in. Now this lace, here the shorter one, is going to remain. It's never going to go through one of the top eyelids. Take the one that's on the same side, thread it from the inside out, go across to the other side, and from the outside in. What you end up with or two laces like this. And it should be even uh, a little bit more even. You can adjust how you start to make sure that the end result is a little bit even. You tie this off with a double knot and then stuff the remaining shoe around the edge of the, around the brim of the boot. And this will give you a full straight lace look. Now, obviously, when you're wearing the boot, you're gonna make this a little bit tighter, but this is a good way to throw a little extra style in. Now, with an even set of eyelets, it's a little bit trickier, depending on how you think about it. It also could be easier, I don't know. 
with this one, what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to start with the top eyelet from the outside of the shoe. Go in, draw the strip, draw the lace in, leaving about six or seven inches of lace at the end. Come all the way down to the fourth eyelet from the bottom of the shoe. So one, two, three, four, and come out of that eyelet. Like so. And this is on the same side of the boot that you started with. Now, you come across to the other side, the same eyelet, fourth up, go outside in, like this. So you have one bar going across from the fourth lace, uh, eyelet up. Now take the longer part of the string, the longer part of the lace, go in from the same side at the very bottom eyelet, and come out. Come over to the same side as the first eyelet, go out in like this. Putting together your first bar at the bottom of the shoe. From this point on, just remember the mantra, up and over, and that's what you're gonna do through the rest of this process. Go up on the same side of the boot, come over to the other side, and go in. Like so. Repeating the mantra, up and over. We're gonna go up one eyelid on the same side, like so, and then go over into the other side. Like this. Now we've reached the fourth bar that we've already started, but we still wanna continue the same mantra and go up. We're gonna skip past that bar and come out the next available eyelet, like so, and then go over. It's pretty straightforward, actually. And as you can see, we have created another bar. And so we're just gonna continue that pattern and that mantra all the way up using the same side of the lace. So up on the same side and out, then come over to the other side. Okay, what's the mantra? Go up and then over again. So up, up one eyelet from the inside and then over. Like so. Be careful not to skip one. Go up one eyelet and then over again. Okay, repeat the process. Obviously, when you're doing this, you don't want to lace them all the way up before you put your foot in or else you will have to basically unlace them to get your foot in again. I usually lace them up to about the third, uh, fourth or fifth eyelet before, and then I slide my shoe in and continue, I mean my foot in and continue after that. So we're gonna go up on the same side and over again. And if you have this many eyelets on your boots, I recommend that you check your work as you go. Just make sure you haven't skipped anything. It really sucks to get really far up here just to find that you missed an eyelet somewhere. It looks really tacky if you do that. So you would, you would have to rip them off and start all over again, okay? Once you get to the top, you still repeat the same pattern, up, over, and you're gonna end on an up. 
with your two laces out, outside here. What you can see here is that I left maybe just a little bit too much lace on this particular side. It takes a little bit of practice depending on your shoe and the size of your lace before you get that right. But with practice, you'll get that well enough. And again, we tie off the boot with a double knot. Like so. And I like to stuff the strings inside. And usually when I pimp these, when I rock these, I will fold my socks over the brim of the boot. I'll show you that in another video to make sure the, the laces are tucked away. And so here you go, two different methods of ladder lacing your boots, also called straight lacing or bar lacing. So thank you for tuning in to this video. I hope you found it useful. Please feel free to contact me on my social media at MacCast Media on Twitter, Facebook, or Instagram. And if you have any questions, comments, or tips about how to do this particular technique, go ahead and leave those in the comments. I'm always interested in finding out new ways to achieve this particular style. All right, thanks for watching the video and bye for now.